What do we have to fight now? Those look mean. Let's kill it. Kill it, kill it dead? Nope, not yet. They survived VV? <gasps> you bastards. Come on, Steiner, kill him. Uh, oh, ew! Why don't you put your web on me? You can't put your ass. I don't want anything from anyone's ass on me. Bye. It's okay to those that don't save the day again. Yay, I learned thunder. Whoop! Into this place. It looks like it is only two buildings, but in fact it is more like... Ten? Gee whiz, a windmill! Vivi, the end is this way. Aw, oh, do we have to? Well, I want to go see the windmill. I know. Let's get some rest first. We also need to decide what to do next. Stares at Garnet with creepy eyes. <gasps> oh, poor Stein. Little kids, do you see that? I sure did! The village of Dolly was nice, pleasant music. Nothing wrong could possibly happen here. We will just sail through this area of the game. No one will be captured, no one will be tortured, no one will be anything. If you couldn't sense the sarcasm in that, then I'm sorry. I know she's cute, but it's rude of you to stare. Oh, I, I, I wasn't looking at the young lady. I was just... Uh, the room is right over there. Make yourselves at home. Um, is it on? Where will I be staying? In the same room. Where else? But, but Zidane, I mustn't. I understand how you feel, but these country inns don't have private rooms. Oh, she wants to stay in a separate room because she's a chick and she's not used to it. It's okay, I don't think anybody in that group will molest you in your sleep. Except possibly Steiner. Tell me one thing before we go to sleep. Will you marry me? Why did you want to leave the castle, Dagger? If the ship hadn't crashed, then we would have arrived at the neighboring Regency of Limblum. You were gonna leave Alexandria? I think you should have realized that. I see. If we hadn't been caught, we would have reached Limblum by now. But now we'll have to cross Southgate on foot. Border crossing, huh? Zidane, please listen. There's a reason I must leave this kingdom. I cannot tell you why, but please. I understand. I'll get you to Limblum somehow. I've had enough! Oh, Steiner. <laughs> Making everybody's lives harder. He may expose you to even more danger, like you did in Evil Forest. I beg of you, Princess, please return with me to the castle. I know I screwed up. He didn't do anything wrong in the Evil Forest. But there's no doubt in my mind now. I pl I'll protect Dagger with my life. You've known her for... Oh, actually, in all seriousness, they have probably known each other a couple days at this point. Because it does take a while to cross over land. Then tell me, how do you intend to take her back to the castle? I, I will think of a way. <laughs> grrr. That is Steiner's grrr face. Oh, Vivi's already sleeping. Master Vivi. He was tired. But then you had to go on a tirade. What? Let's go to sleep. And completely ignore Steiner's existence. Poor Steiner. Wait for it. Aww.
what a beautiful voice. Who's singing? Well, Dagger, obviously. I know that song really well, and I really like it. It's called Melodies of Life. I've heard that song. I've never heard a song like that before. Was that Dagger singing? Oh, everyone's up already. Wonder where they went. Time for some ATEs, guys! Vivi is confused. Poor Vivi. Ouch! What's going on? They saw Vivi and are immediately terrified. Oh, poor Vivi. It's okay, Vivi. I love you anyway. Are they avoiding me? Oh, I'll give you a hug, Vivi. It's okay. It's okay. Come here. Come here. Come here. I'll give you a hug now. And yes, I just hugged my um, monitor. <laughs> I think there's some things here. Yep! We got a potion! And... An antidote! This music is so soothing. Oh, Dagger tries. She's trying really, really hard to be like a normal girl. I wonder... I wonder if the castle's okay. That was quite a ruckus. Mother went too far. She didn't have to fire the ship, even if she did to rescue me. She nearly killed you! Were you watching that cutscene, Honey Buns? Some people could have died like an evil forest. You're in my way, kiddo! Kiddo? Oh, my apologies. I'm, I mean, I'm sorry. Kids these days! Getting in the way with... Had another hiccup in recording there, but we are back. And I have a Moogle to talk to. Let's give Gumo a letter. Koopo to Monty. Did I forget to give Monty that letter? Son of a bitch! Okay, let's save our game just in case something else happens again. Now we're sitting all by myself. And the guy is yet again sleeping at his desk. Now let's go see if we can find Garnet. Cat's eye. Wonder what this could be. Oh, getting caught on my controller there. There we go. Oh, it's a kitty! Oh, it's you. Oh, what should I do? I don't want to give in to my brother, but everyone else making money except me. Dot 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 dot. Stop it. Everyone in this game likes to be Squall. I won't have to give in if I tell them about them. Oh no. Who's he gonna tell who about who and what's it? This isn't going to end well for us, is it? Hi, Vivi! Hey, Vivi, what's up? Zidane! N nothing, I was just thinking. I see. You met a girl. Oh god. N no, no, nothing like that. What? Don't tell me you don't like girls. That's totally okay if you don't, baby. I never really thought about stuff like that. I'm always thinking about girls. I'm popular with all the ladies in Limblum. Sure you are, Sidon. Sure you are. Come to me if you're having a girl trouble, okay? Sh sure. Thanks. Okay, then we need to decide what to do. I'm gonna go look for Dagger and Rusty. Would you mind heading back to the inn? Y sure, I'll head back. So, what were we staring at? Nothing. But I kept hearing a sound like quack. That sounds that's the sound chocobos make. I'm just waiting for the sound, nothing happens. See you back at the inn. Okay. What are chocobos? Chocobo? Goodbye. <laughs> Phoebe has been Phoebe-napped! From right behind Zidane. 
Forget Steiner, I wonder where Dagger is. Oh, nobody cares about- nobody cares about poor little, uh, poor little Steiner. <laughs> oh, the look on his face! He sent someone to pick it up right away! All I need to do now is keep quiet until the guests leave. Gotta pretend I'm asleep. You son of a bitch, you got Vivi kidnapped! <sighs> Jerk. Well, I guess we have a dagger to go find. Oh, dagger? Honey buttons? Love interest and heroine of the game! Oh, dagger tries harder. She tries so hard to be normal. But she's the opposite. I must speak with this girl on how common folks speak. Welcome! Um, yes, can, can we talk for a bit? Talk? What should I say? Um... I'm- she is not from the country, I'm sorry, Dagger. You look nothing like somebody from the country. Yacha, can't you see I'm with a customer? But I just heard something awesome! Can't you see that I'm working? Um, please, I mean, don't mind me. Here's a chance to listen on some conversation. She's so excited. I picture Garnett being so excited. I get to learn how common folks speak. I can be a real girl. Okay, so now we know where Dagger is. Let's go find her. And cause her to have a heart attack. Dagger. What's she looking at? She gets right up in her face, breaking her personal bubble. Wait for it. Oh, hi! You got a fever or something? Your face is all red. It's, it's nothing, I'm fine. You're acting strange. What? I get it! You changed the way you talk, you're doing great. Thanks. I did fine in the play, didn't I? Oh yeah, I thought you were <laughs> You sure know how to fake it. <laughs> now let's be nice. I'm a big fan of Lord Avon's plays. I mean, I have- I mean, I've seen all of them. I want to be a canary as one of my favorites. Oh yeah? Is Ruby the young lady with a strange accent? Oh, yeah. Should I talk more like her? What? No, 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 no. She's really finicky about her speech. She always laughs at us whenever we try to mimic her. So you should just be yourself, Dagger. I understand. Alrighty. Aww. They're having a little moment. That's cute. We need to decide what to do from here. Will you go back to the inn? What about you? I'll head back soon. Alrighty, I'll catch you later. Good, you sound just like a regular village girl. <laughs> Crossing the border might not be so tough after all. Thanks, I had fun. And she bows. <laughs> Okay, now let's try and figure out what Garnet was staring at. She was staring at useful information about learning new abilities. And playing cards. Not something naughty, chat. Okay, anything that we need. Ooh. Mmm, mmm, uh. Um. You know what? Very quickly, it's a wrist. And, uh, leather hat? I can't remember. Anyway. We're gonna do something really, really weird. Trust me, I have a reason for this. Yes, I just bought 99 wrists. No, I'm not going to buy a sword, sword for Steiner, because I'm pretty sure I get an iron sword pretty quickly anyway. Um, let's not save for now. Worry about that later. <laughs>